Alright, welcome back to another video on the channel and today I'm going to be showing you how you can change the speed of video clips in iMovie. So here I've got a, just a 24.7 second uh, clip of gameplay from Forza and I'll be using this to demonstrate how you can change the speed. So the first thing you want to do is get your desired video clip in the editing timeline down here. Then you want to select on that video clip and then go to the top right over here and click on this speedometer icon. Once you click on the speedometer icon, you can go here to the left and click on this drop down arrow and it gives you a few options for controlling the speed of your video clip. So there's some default options such as slow and fast. So if you click on slow, you can see that it gives some options such as 10%, 25%, or 50%. And if you wanna make it faster, you can do either twice as fast, four times as fast, or all the way up to 20 times as fast. But personally, I like to pick custom because this allows me to pick the specific speed that works best for me. So um, obviously, if you have 100% in the speed, uh, it's going to be just the normal, uh, normal speed of the video clip. So if we want to make it um, uh, just um, half as fast, then we can just put in 50% and now it will be um, slower. So you can see that now the video clip has... Um, gotten significantly slower, it's gone from 27 seconds to 47 sec 49 seconds. If we want to make the video clip, let's say, uh, four times as fast, you can put in 400%. And now you can see that the video clip is just 6.2 seconds long, and if we play it, you can see it's much faster. So that's how you can change the speed of video clips. There's also a few other options, such as if you want to reverse the video, you can now see that if I play it, it's actually going to reverse the video. Um, so yeah, again, just click on your desired clip. Click on the speedometer icon. And then over here in the drop down arrow, just go to custom or one of the default options. Put in your percentage of the change in speed. And voila, your video clip should be at a different speed. That's it for the tutorial today. Uh, thank you so much for watching all the way to the end of the video. And if you like this, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.